everybody, this is Roy from Team Rank, and I'm here to react to Ruby, Volume 3, World of Remnant, The Four Maidens, which is about the seasons that Ozpin and Pyrrha talked about. And without further ado, let's react. Four maidens. Deep in the forests of Remnant, beside a great and mighty river, stood the small, fragile home of a cold, frail man. Mm -hmm. A lone wizard. Hidden from the dangers of oh, the like magic. World, the wizard seldom had visitors, but on this day, as he peered out his window, his gaze fell upon a young maiden. Winter. Calmly she sat beneath his tree in a state of absolute tranquility. When the wizard demanded an explanation, the maiden simply replied, My name is Winter. I am on a journey. And the person's name is Winter. For my sisters. With that, she closed her eyes and sat in silence. The wizard told himself the girl was a fool, but the longer she sat, the more he wished to share in the serenity the young maiden enjoyed. In time, he grew tired and decided to close his eyes as well, thinking on this strange predicament. Upon opening his eyes, the wizard was befuddled oh, to find that strength. a second maiden had appeared beneath his tree, cheerful and spry, with a basket of fruit and flowers. When he asked for an explanation, the girl simply replied, My name is Spring. I am on a journey. And I am waiting for my sisters. To show her gratitude for his reluctant hospitality, the girl retrieved a handful of seeds from her basket and planted them in the wizard's garden. Some of the expressions remind me of Ruby when I see spring. The old hermit well, she has a good green thumb. Once a mere pile of dirt and manure into a pure oh, she could work with. From which life would surely okay, she could work there too. It's likely he would have gazed for hours, were it not for the unfamiliar laughter he heard from beneath his tree. A young woman, fall or summer, stood beside the two maidens. But going by the thing, it should be summer. Herself, to which she happily responded, My name is Summer. Yeah, Summer. I'm on a journey, and I am waiting for my sister. Of course, thought the wizard. But another chirp of laughter left the old man perplexed. What in the world was so funny? As it turned out, it was him. The new arrival found the wizard's insistence on staying indoors so very amusing. Why choose to view the world through a small window when the door leading out to it was right at his side? was a compelling argument, and after only a moment of oh, yeah. hesitation, Summer was the one that convinced him to go out. His home and stepped outside. The warmth the sun brought with it a surge of energy and life, and soon the wizard wasn't feeling much like himself anymore. What? Oh, yeah, just convince him to go. Thanksgiving with a table like that. Winter set the table. Spring supplied the crops. Summer prepped the meal, and the wizard was the happiest he'd been in ages. So we're small. But in all the excitement, he nearly failed to notice the delicate woman that now stood. Ah, here's small. He smiled and beckoned her to join him, asking only for her name. My name is Fall, she replied softly. I am on a journey and am here to meet my sisters. Who are you? Me? The wizard wondered. Well, I am but an old hermit. I have lived in these woods alone for centuries, and I'm afraid my story is not very interesting, as I have no one to love and nothing to my name. 
The eldest sister looked up at all that surrounded them. Oh, she's the eldest? But sir, do you not see? You have so much. It was true. With their help, it was now clear to see that the wizard had everything he could ever need. He was grateful. But a question lingered in his mind. Why me? He asked. Why did the four of you choose to open my eyes? To share with me your gifts? Why am I so special? The four sisters looked to one another, perplexed. Finally, the eldest spoke. I beg your pardon, sir, but we did not do these things for you because you were special. We do what we can for everyone because we are able. The old wizard was at a loss. Never in his years had he come across such kindness. It was in that moment that he knew what should be done. Oh, this is when he gets some magic. Summoned his magic. Every ounce he could muster, and bestowed him upon the sisters. Oh. He smiled. Take this gift, and know now that you are able to do so much more. Now, armed with the elements, the very powers of uh, nature, winter, and the unimaginable magic of the wizard, spring and maidens, summer, winter, spring, summer, and fall, and fall, promise to carry onward with their journey, using their gifts to aid others, just as they had aided him. One by one, the sisters left. Before they did, they made one final promise. Promise to return each and every year to visit their dear friend. Uh, does that mean he's still alive? In the. Okay, let me just pause that, seeing it's to end. Okay, that was interesting. Like, more interesting interactions with the fairy tale of the seasons. And. Hmm. And it was kind of interesting to find out that. Fall was the oldest. I was kind of actually thinking Fall was the second oldest, with Winter being the oldest one. But that's just because of the the order of the seasons come by. Because I thought Spring would be youngest, Summer would be the second youngest, um, Fall would be the second oldest, and Winter would be the oldest one. But oh well. <laughs> Anyway, uh, I would say that was really enlightening on, on more on how the sisters, I mean, how this, how spring, summer, fall, and winter got their abilities from the old man, and it shows more interaction and how much time the old wizard spent with this, the original maidens, and it's also to note that there's a thing Austin said, who's obviously the narrator for this. Um, it's that it's that the maidens, the visit, maidens him visit him each year. Each year. Does this mean does when this the mean when the maidens passed away, away, the original, the maidens, original passed maidens passed away, that that the new maidens, the new maidens visit the old man too, or, or, or did or did old man pass away, away pass before, before the, the original maidens original maidens away? I don't know. I don't know. I'm still I'm still questions after that. But it would be interesting, would be to, interesting see to, old, to see if the old, the old wizard, the old wizard happens, to be, happens to be can live a long, live time, a long time. time. But given the thing, given the thing, uh, 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 how, given the timing, given the timing, he probably passed away, away before the maidens. Before the maidens. So, so uh, I don't have uh, anything don't else, have anything else to say. To say, but but if you're wondering, if you're wondering, the video, drop the video. What's, what's that? We're hearing, we're hearing clanking, clanking. You didn't notice. Didn't notice. I'm currently, I'm currently holding, holding this in my this in my fingers fingers where i mean wearing where, these i mean on wearing my these fingers, on my fingers. So I'll just, ignore so I'll just ignore that and if you see and if you see the fact that i look like i just woke up well obviously i just obviously woke up, I just woke anyway, up. Without, anyway, further ado, without further ado uh see ya uh,